They're often pacing in between horses keep on moving left well. From the far outside, Arizona moves up. In between those two is Marymount and Arizona's three wide to take the lead. Marymount moves up to be second, holding the inside third. Keep on moving, coming away fourth is Corky's Nutshell. Racing with the leaders fifth. We all know three lanes back, Perfect Tannic sixth and seventh. Lake Hill's mom HP's grand finale, the early trailer. They move by the quarter, 29 and 1. By the grandstand for the first time, Arizona strong on top as she leads by two and a half lengths. Racing second, Marymount closing the gap third. Keep on moving. It's a four length gap to Corky's Nutshell fourth. Another three back to We All Know fifth. Perfect Tannic sixth. Lake Hills Mom seventh. HP's grand finale trails. No change in position. They'll go to the half-mile pole, same way they went the quarter with Arizona in control. They're halfway home in a minute straight, and Arizona takes them onto the back stretch. A length and a half in front, Marymount racing second. Keep on moving, contemplating, pulling from third, and there she goes. And right behind her fourth, Corky's nutshell, we all know is a strong fifth and just three and a half from the leader. Then Perfect Tannic on the outside, sixth, racing seventh, Lake Hills Mom, HP's grand finale still can see them all. They pick up the pace around the far turn. Arizona leads a length. Keep on moving. Parked on the outside. Second, three quarters, 129 and four. Arizona on the inside. Keep on moving on the outside. These two battle for the lead. Corky's nutshell will tip wide for the drive as they turn for the money. Keep on moving now takes the lead a length and a half. Corky's nutshell closing up on the outside. Second, Arizona trying to fight back third. Here comes, we all know, Lake Hills Bomb and HP's grand finale's on the grandstand side and she is rolling up on the outside. HP's grand finale, but on the inside, Corky's nutshell may have come back with we all know, very tight. Corky's nutshell, we all know, HP's grand finale, it's close. Into the winner's circle, the upset winner, number two, we all know, owned by Leopold Sawyers and Bruce Pacitti. Bruce Pacitti trains and Leopold Sawyer drives. This Illinois bred four-year-old daughter of Happy Wizard out of the steady star mare, only I know. Your rundown for the fifth race, 216-854. Seven and three, 201 and two is a new mark for we all know. In tonight's sixth race, no changes. Perfect the wagering on the sixth post time in 17 minutes at 945. Now it's back to Maywood. Ladies and gentlemen, horses are coming out for Maywood Park's fifth race. Perfect the wagering number three, Magellan has been scratched. In your card in the specially marked boxes located around the track. 